So today on Stone Valley, we are going to be maxing out the amount of animals that we could get, fertilizing a bunch of fields, and we're going to be planting the big ones. If you don't remember, these fields are literally one now. Oh no, I'm driving through the main farm. No, slow down. Wow, that's close. And then this whole area is one field as well. Field 10, field 5, and field number 4. There is a little itty bitty sliver on field 5. I don't know. I haven't done anything with it. Just don't feel like it. And then field three is by itself. But what I'm going to do is we're going to go ahead and take this and I'm going to just top off the sheep. Why did I have a dump trigger back there? That was confusing. I'm going to max out the amount of sheep that we have. We've got, what, 400 out of 1,000 right now. We're just going to buy some more adult sheep. And that's really going to be it. 60, please. Can I have 60? There you go, there's 32 grand down so far. And I don't know how many times I had to do that, but I think that was about $300,000. All right, dump in the grass. And of course, we got to hook up to this thing as well. Yeah, man, I totally forgot about how cool this mod was. Hey, if you guys are not using these mods, you definitely got to use these because they are just epic. All right, we'll place this down right here, ish. Just leave it sit here. I'm checking the sheep to see how we're doing with water. Uh, they're filling up, but it's a little bit confusing because it says water's all the way up. But, I don't know what it is. Water's not accepted here. Water's totally accepted there. But it's, it's good. It's, it's done. All right. And then whatever's left, we'll just kind of toss in here. And then I slow down. I don't have good brakes. Why don't my brakes work? Oh, I think I know why my brakes don't work. Um... <laughs> we're gonna have to we have to work on this a little bit twelve thousand dollars to repair this thing goodness gracious there you go well at least it's working now and seems like the brakes are working that's good we're also gonna take this as well because i think this will hold tmr if i do the short version there we go hook up that would be a no no it does not another thing we're gonna do while we're quick is we're gonna take this guy because i don't think i repaired this either all right, well, I didn't have to repair it too bad. There we go, there we go, there we go. I am gonna kind of configure, oh, nope, that's not what I wanted. What I want is this, the engine. Uh, we've got a pretty good engine in there right now, but I definitely want the 1100 horsepower. So that is what we're gonna go with. Oh no, there's a different engine in here that I remember. 1582, oh, yes, please. Got, yeah, yeah, yeah. Start it up and get to it. It's also got a CVT transmission in it, which might be better for doing field work. It's definitely moving pretty good, much, much smoother. And while that's filling up with TMR, let's fill up our cow barn. So we do have some babies in here right now. Uh, let's see, seven months, and then we've got some 25 months. So uh, these seven months, we're gonna hang on to those right now. There's really, I don't know, I really just don't care. It is what it is. Let's, let's go with, oh wait, hang on. Seven months, 25 months. So I guess the 18 months is the way to go. Let's do it. That's a lot of money gone. We're down 1.6. I think that costs like 1.3 or 1.4 million dollars for all those cows. Oof. Pull the TMR though, so that works for me just fine. We'll take this over. David did put a thing in here. So tip side back, tip side grain door. This should be beneficial, at least for us today, trying to get this and here, oh man, I don't even know if we're gonna be able to fit this in there. Best backwards driver in farm sim, come on, DJ, yeah! Oh, 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 We got the tip trigger all the way from out here. So we'll see, is this gonna empty out as fast as I want it to? Fast enough, whatever, all right. We'll let's take a look at the cattle real quick, see how the food's going. So TMR is going up, it's going up very quickly. That's good for us. Uh, the only other thing that we'll need to do is no water, so straw, yeah, that's it. And I wasn't quite sure how much straw we would need, so I just went in and filled this up since we've got plenty of it and plenty of money as well. Go and dump this here. Now, I do have it set to hold 500,000 liters of straw, so half as much as the food itself. Should fill that up and should be just fine. We should also get a ton of money. We have a 238. Yo, here's something I hadn't checked in a minute. A hot minute. How much like food stuff they have? So slurry, we're two hundred thirty-eight thousand. We only got one hundred and eighty-three thousand liters of manure. This thing holds four million liters. Would love to take that to like the last day that we're doing this, and just you know, just kick it. 
I don't think that'd be so funny. All right, so we're back in. We'll go ahead and take the straw. We'll dump it out back in the silo. Oh, and then I think we're going to be ready to start fertilizing. Yeah, should be good. So we're going to run two on this. I'm still going to run this spray array here, but I'm also going to just get another one of these because now we've got some pretty massive areas that need to be done up. So we need to make sure that we've got plenty of room and plenty of area and plenty of everything and plenty of repair this thing because I think it needs it. Yeah. So I think for this field, I'm going to run just this guy right here, but we do need to go ahead and find ourselves a new sprayer. You know, it's funny at the beginning of everything, I spent $100,000 on one of these or 94 and I quickly sold it back because I realized I couldn't afford it. And here we are like four episodes from the very end and I bought one for fun. Oh, that's so me. All right, all we need is one headland around this field right here, which is field number three, and then I can hire a worker, and this dude will be good. As you can see, I've already got that other sprayer sitting there waiting. I ain't going full yet. Don't worry. I ain't doing nothing without you guys. Uh-oh. I did I don't know how I did this, but well, what's in there? All right. It is definitely in there. Oh, that's not good. At least it unfolds from the outside first. Yep. Yeah, we're doing good. And then line it up to wearing a hire worker. Boom. Done. Now we get the big boy right here. I went with the full sprayer arm support. I don't know how long it is. I think it's 40 meters. He's having a good time, isn't he? <laughs> yeah, I think this is 40 meters. It's, it's going to be fun. Honestly, I don't prefer these trailed versions. I much, much prefer the uh well those versions like that but you know what this gets the job done and it'll get the job done quickly and it'll 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 be fine i'll, I'll be okay wonder how the the outline's gonna look after i get this done off on a single headland well, that's gonna be hilarious it's looking good very good actually making my way down to the end pretty quick Check that spread out right there. Yay! Coming around through towards the main area now on the cattle farm that we did the last time. Man, this is going to look so cool. Just completely full of crop or whatever we decide to put in here. I also really, really need to figure out what in the world I'm going to put in this area. I'm still thinking, like, all right, so this is the winning idea right now. Maybe you guys will have to help me out with this. I'm thinking about planting grass or just painting grass and then putting a bunch of trees there. Yeah! No? All right, maybe we'll do something else. <laughs> now, this is going to be the real interesting task is trying to find a spot where the worker wants to do the job. But look at that. One whole pass almost to the time that it took this dude to do the entire area. That's great. Now it's all going to come down to spot spraying-ish. Not in the same terminology that you would say. Hey, um, none of that was words, and that belongs to the blooper video, but I'm going to keep talking anyway. I'm going to hit all the spots that this dude decided not to hit. I'm spot spraying. Yeah. You know, it's bad when you run a single headland around the field and this, that much is all that gets missed. Boy. Now is going to be hiring a worker over here. I would like the worker to, I don't know, hit most of this. So for some of it, I'm just going to run myself because there's no point to hire a worker to do some of these easy spots. However, when we get to the bigger spots, I'm going to do that. That way, we can just go back and forth, have the worker do it be nice and easy. All right, so there's one thing that I need to do because I have noticed that this idiot right here is missing quite a bit down here at the bottom in the end, and he's also taking full of uh, doing this. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to help him. I'm going to hit an extra little bit here at the ends just so maybe, just so maybe this idiot won't completely screw it all up, and I'm going to try and hit as much as I can on the way up there as well. There's, I mean, there's no point to do not as much as I would. Yeah, yep, up, up. Best driver in farm sim. Actually, you know what? Instead of helping this idiot, I'm just gonna let him struggle bus. I'm gonna hit some of these little spots for myself. Ooh, got the little one right there, got it. Yeah, he's missing a whole lot down here at the top. So I'm just gonna, just gonna do this. Yeah, this'll work. I think down and back one more time, maybe twice, but I think probably one more time. Might even hit this whole thing. All right, so we've hit this much. I'm going to make you deal. I'm going to go up through here. And then once we get to the top, I'm going to go across. Because we got all this mess dude has missed. And if he ain't done with this yet, I'll hit that. All right, so I've hit this, but I don't think there's any way that we're going to get over there before dude does. I don't know. Let's, let's give it a try and see. I'm going to hire a worker just to see. 
Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, it's gonna be a little bit easier than I thought. Oh, 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 look at that! Oh! Yo! That's no way to make that better! That was incredible! You know, I feel like anything that I'm gonna do in Farming Simulator now is just gonna be so inadequate because that was incredible. All right, so here's dude right here. He's gonna do just fine, but I do think he's gonna miss a few little spots. I miss this. Oh, oh, that's already good. All right, whatever. I do think he's gonna miss a little bit, so I'm just gonna come up behind him with this. We'll spray that, and then we're actually done with this entire bit right here. I do need to spray the grass field, so there is that. You know what? I'm gonna let him do his own thing. I'm gonna go spray the grass fields. Not saying I forgot that I can't do this yet, but uh, we probably shouldn't, not just yet, because I need to put down grass. Oh yeah, oh, I hit that, uh, that didn't. What just looked like happened, that did not happen. We're good. This also might be just a little bit overkill for the job at hand, but you know what? I'm not sure if I'm actually known for anything other than that. So we're right on par. Put it down, drop it on, do the thing. Plant some grass through here. There you go. That's pretty easy. And now, coming through here, this is all gonna be one big old field, which works best for me. There you go. We're even painting it in. Yeah. I do kinda wanna get field number one as well, but I think if I do that, I wanna do field um, two, six, one, 16, and seven and make this one big field. And I kinda wanna make this one big field at the end of the day as well, but right now it's two. So maybe one day we'll do that, but I don't think it's gonna happen at least in the first bit of this series. Wow, that is not straight at all. Good job, DJ. You know, I've just realized that I want more tractors and I still want field number one, but there's, why? There's no point, we have one harvest left. It's gonna be a fall harvest this year. There is no, 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 no reason to do it. Oh, but I want another tractor. And there she is right here. So I know that a lot of you guys don't have Carl Steiger yet. So instead of using Carl Steiger on here, I'm going to use the base game one. <laughs> yes, that's right. This one, the base game one. I don't want to use the big, big, big one because there's really no point to do that. But I think this will look cool. Plus... A lot more horsepower? Maybe, actually, I don't know if we need that much horsepower. Uh, it's not that much difference. Oh boy, where did it go? Oh, it's over here. Actually kind of the perfect place for this. Where's my planter? May have forgotten how slow these things are. That's definitely not something that's cool. I think it's right here. Uh, yeah, the planter's in there, but we're gonna have to move something. Starting up combine harvester in March, why not? Don't hit the tractor, don't hit the tractor, don't hit the tractor. Nice. All right, here we go. Let's hook up to it. Make sure we got enough seed, which we do not. Um, by the way, we are doing a super, super stereotypical last harvest here on the farm. We're going to be doing grass and oats. Oh, yeah. You guys know you missed it. There's a truck in the way. Fill it up with seed. 10,000 liters of seed ain't too bad in here. Well, actually, I don't know how much filled it. You know what? Some seed went in, and that's okay. That's a good thing. I do love that this thing's not even losing any miles per hour while it's going uphill. Oh, that's so nice. Ooh, yes, sir. Oh, I love the big tractor. Let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, so we got the biggest planter that, that money could buy us, at least at the time, but well, still kinda. I do need to enable fast farming or otherwise this is gonna take a long time. And we'll turn it on. Oh, that articulating tractor is driving exactly like I was worried that it would. <laughs> what I will do is I'm running two runs around uh, each field, and then we'll kind of let him do his thing after that. It is going to take a long time, and I mean a long time, to actually let this guy do his job. So I'm going to try and get as much of this done now as I can, but minimum, of course, we got to run these two headlands around the entire field. And hire him on a worker. We're going to do the same thing on field number three. And with the worker hired. Oh, man, this thing looks good. I don't know why I didn't go with big case equipment to start with. Should have just saved my money and bought this thing. <laughs> Imagine being in a car on the side of the road, going the speed limit, and not being able to keep up with a tractor in the field. Oh, boy. This is one of the things I love about creating fields, because you're not really sure how it's going to look until the worker, or whoever goes over these spots 
Speaking of spots, you missed one. Oh, it's because you look like you're. I don't. I don't. You got a mustache. That's what you got. And sunglasses. Get out of here. Right, so there is one thing I'm gonna do real quick because it looks like this whole area is needing a little bit of a, a smoothing out. There is a bit of a dip going straight through the middle, and I think that's why it's missed a few things. So I'm just gonna go through here. I'm gonna zoom this in real quick, or you know, smooth it out. And then I'm gonna do a much larger version here as well, all the way on the out. Maybe, maybe this will hit it. I hope so. Actually, I should do this to a bunch of these areas because they are gonna need it big time. Here we go. This should do it now. I don't think there's any more spots that are kind of like that. I'm also gonna hit the edges here because sometimes edges of fields can be a little bit fun or not so fun. So we'll just smooth out these while we've got it. Actually, this whole area. I'm gonna flatten that spot out, but right now these will be okay. There you go, all right. Hey, wait a minute. Dummy number one. You missed a spot <laughs> right here. What is this? Look at him lumbering about. Oh, that spot? Oh, I didn't, I didn't know you wanted me to do that spot too. Oh, okay, well, yeah, I can, I can do it for you. It's gonna cost extra, but I got it. Arrgh! All right, let's keep going. <laughs> All right, pass number one is completed. Uh, we have used a total of uh, 35-ish hundred liters of seed on all of that, which is a lot. Oh, and that was just the first pass. Here it is, right there, you can see. Not too shabby, not too shabby at all. It is really neat seeing these spots. I do have to hit that again, but it is really neat seeing some of these spots. That's so cool. All right, I'm gonna hit one more, and then I think from there, we're probably gonna have to break it up at least for today. All right, so these little spots, I talked about these, uh, they disappeared. Look at that. I guess with a cultivator or something like that, or a brush cutter possibly, but <laughs> they're gone, man. Ooh, just like me. Bye. 